everyone, Retro Girls UK is back for another episode of What's in the Box? A ginormous box! So let's open it and see what it is. Okay, so we do have an enormous box. The t shirt is a little bit of a clue of what's in there. So let's open up this bad boy. It's so big. Hang on. And the struggle is real. Uh, struggle is definitely real. <laughs> and we have Star Wars the Child Grogu pop figure. Look at the size of this bad boy. And it's number 369. And then, oh, I've just hit the second face. And then on the back, it's still the pop figures to the whole collection. And then on the top it says pop and half of his face. Our most favourite series, better than Boba Fett. Yeah, Michelle Bins Watts Mandoria. Within a day. Yeah, literally. <sighs> Don't damage it. I'll try not to. Put tape on the box, you know. Yeah, the box. Good job we don't keep it in the box then. Uh -huh. So, oh, this is really nice. It's a bubble. It's a bubble head. Of Grogu. Is that his name? Yeah. yeah. Lisa's never watched it, so. <laughs> and on here, on the um, stand there, it says Star Wars. Yep. Michelle kindly pan through it. And then, oh. And the camera van. And then on the back, it's got some really nice details. Well, I feel that sure. Yeah, it's nice and like textured. So yeah. it's, let me feel the weight of it. Oh, that's um, quite heavy. Whoops. Any... I'm joking. Right, let's have a look at the bottom. And then on the bottom, Lucas Films Funko Made in China. I think that said. Yeah. Made in China. Lucas Funko LLC 2020 Made in China. Yep. So it, it is a. Giant pop figure. Compared to, let me grab a normal pop figure for and you. It's like a bubbly head as well. Okay. Well, you got a giant one. No, no. This is a different sort. Oh yeah. <laughs> comparison. That's the reptile one. Hold it at the bottom. And then that's look. the difference in size. So look at the size of this little fella. And then look at the size of this big fella. And it's not. It's bigger than my hand. Yeah, literally. But I have the like the smallest hands in the world, and I'm struggling to hold it with one end. But. That is really nice detail, well worth the money. That was from Amazon. Uh, I can't remember the exact price. 30 or 33, I can't remember. Yeah, I think it was £30. Well worth the money, little bubbly head. It's best thing for any fan if you want it as a, a display piece next to your Star Wars. Exactly. I think this is like the biggest pop figure I've ever come across. It's bigger than the one that you unboxed last episode. Yeah. Alright, look at the size of that box. It's even got some um, picture inside, huh? This logo. Yeah. I'll show you inside. So that's what it looks like closer. It's got a little bit of tape, which it looks like. You know what? This tape is baffling me. Like, what's with the tape? Let me see if it's. No, it's just wrapping what they're getting packaged. So, damn it, I'm about to take it off. Ah, I thought the box is damaged then. That's the details. So yeah, this is the unboxing of the pop figure Grogu from Mandalorian. Perfect for any Star Wars fan like Michelle behind the camera. I'm struggling to hold it. It's that big. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed today's video. I put it there nice and safe. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, comment and share. Don't forget to join us on all of our social medias. All the links will be and down And comment below. down below if you have this uh, pop figure or if you have any other Star Wars ones or giant pop figures that you think are good suggestions for us to buy. Yep. So thank you for watching and we'll see you on the next video.